Arroz caldo is a Filipino stew of chicken and rice cooked in chicken broth enhanced with ginger. Though the name is Spanish, arroz meaning rice and caldo meaning broth or soup, the dish is actually a Filipino version of the Chinese kanji or porridge. This Filipino dish shows its unique multicultural heritage found in many Filipino cuisine. It's currently 5.30 in the morning. Bold rice and uh, what? Bold, bold rice and uh, put those uh, cooked uh, chicken wings and then uh, you add the ingredients uh, ginger, garlic and onion, salt and pepper and boil them up. That's all. <laughs> With the rice, broth, and the chicken, the porridge also contains ginger, garlic, and onions, and of course, salt and pepper. As you can see in the chicken, the bones are attached, as well as chicken liver, which Miss Mimi added to this dish. Miss Mimi is making this dish early in the morning because arroz caldo is eaten primarily for breakfast, or in some cases, late supper. And for many Filipino farmers, both meals will have arroz caldo as its main dish. I got nothing to say, but it's okay. Good morning, good morning. At the table, the porridge is offered with roasted garlic, diced scallions, calamansit, which is a native lime of the Philippines, and some patis, which is right next to the scallions. Personally, I don't like patis with this dish. I see how arroz caldo is considered as a farmer's breakfast. The closest thing in the United States would be oatmeal without the, the chicken. Although keep in mind that they probably put chicken in the oatmeal. It would not, I'm not sure it would taste any, would taste the same. Uh, we're just considering the consistency, not exactly the taste. Oatmeal and arroz caldo with, with the rice different taste I'm sure of it well I know of it a uh, couple of things you can add with the uh, Roscaldo you can this is uh, boiled egg slice it up add it on I do believe they do that in uh, the, uh, the United States and uh, some people will after they have eaten all the um, after they've eaten the chicken they would have seconds and add the, uh, the 
my favorite again, the fish bacon or PO. Now I know that some people actually uh, put bacon on their oatmeal at home. So that's it. This would be our scaldo. Tout ça, c'est à cause des fidèles. Ils les rendent tous fous. Et alors, c'est la faute à fidèles.